Hey, hello everyone, and welcome back to The Legend of Zelda, Tears of the Kingdom. In the last part, we left off with, um, I just been a little bit, but I still remember, um, give me a second to think. Come on. Yeah, I can actually do it the way, come on. And then it's broke one. Anyway. Yes, we left off in the Gerudo Highland on our way to Gerudo Town to begin the Riju part of the main story. Um, after we get the Riju part done, I will probably try to get the rest of the map. But for now, we're focusing on Gerudo. If I can figure out how to get there without getting... Um, yeah, I'm, I think I'm even going the right way, to be honest. Let's see, let's look at the map here. Yeah, wait. Mm. Okay. Yeah, I should probably go the other way. Go this way up the mountain. And I've only got one stamina wheel, so I've got to be careful about how I climb to. I've got this ruby shield, and that's how I'm staying so uh so warm but um climbing up the mountain hopefully oh my stamina is already getting low i'm gonna go to the sledge over here oh and there's a uh We're going this way because it'll just be a little bit easier. Um, hmm, uh oh, he got his stamina food. Um, no, just cold resistance. Shoot, oh, okay, let go for a second. Oh. Better spot to go up than oh, over here. Yeah, I had a better idea to go up this way. Okie doke. So we're making our way to the Gerudo area. There's a tumbleweed. Don't really need it. Yeah, we'll go around. This will be just a bit easier than trying to go the other way. All right. Ooh, some true. All right. Yeah, because I did a little hop just to make it easier. And we need to go this way. <gasps> There's a dragon! Dragon! And I know who it is, too. But I'm not going to tell you, because that would spoil the story. And I don't want to spoil the story for you guys. So let's just say that it's someone important and leave it at that for now. And in the meantime, we're just going to keep climbing up to get to the, where the tower is for the Gerudo area. I'm going to start with the tower and make our way to Gerudo Town from there. Okay, we're almost... Oh. Oh, no. Go. See if you don't give up easy. Link will eventually get all stamina back and make the climb. But we are going to take a short stamina break right here on this ledge so he can gain back what he lost. Alright. Take a short stamina break. I 
one thing that's good about not going in blind is that you know all the little tricks to regain stamina. Okie doke. All right. We're almost to the top. All right, we are up. We just have to go this way to get to the tower to map the gorilla area. I don't want to fight you, dude. Not fighting you, dude. Oh, are you kidding me? Oh, you jerk. Oh, oh I'm pushing the wrong button. I, oh, oh, are you kidding me right now? No. Uh, where are we at? We're at six minutes. The one thing I have noticed with the Tears of the Kingdom videos is that people seem to be more willing on longer parts. So. Okay, so I'm just starting from right here. That's fine. Well, we'll just do what we did before. We'll just go around. Whoopsie. And I'm keeping two of them on just in case I need them to help me fly somewhere. Not that there's much. Oh, yeah. I want my joy to a little messed up. Oh, I didn't mean to crouch. <laughs> oh, what you two? Leave me alone. Okay. Oh, and yeah, there's this. I didn't even realize this was over here. Boink. That will actually help me get a leg up on the climb. Yay! I only died there because I was not being as careful as I should have been. I lost the heart. Let me press some healers. So I'm not going to use my egg yet. But I will eat a piece of meat to get my heart back. There we go. Let's see if we climb more over the map. We actually can serve stamina a little more that way. And it doesn't deplete nearly as fast. It still depletes, it's just not as. Oh, we should have gone on the other ledge there that has the. Oh well. It will. Just maybe. No, oh crap. <laughs> Nope, not yet, Link. What are we at right now? Okay, we're good. Nine minutes, that's fine. Oh, and that's just, oh, that's just your club too. I thought for sure there was a ledge. I guess not. We didn't go all the way down, at least. I'm 
this wouldn't be taking this long if I didn't have to keep replenishing my stamina, but oh, it's okay. It's all good. We are at 10 minutes. Almost at the top. This is actually kind of a little bit of a ledge. If you look at it right, see? Kind of a little bit of a ledge if you look at it right. Oh, we're almost to the top. Almost to the top. Okay. Well. Full stamina wheel. Climb up there. There we are. Okay. Yeah, we're good. I think we'll make it. Okay, we've almost got this. Back to the S, baby. Okay, yeah. Back to the F. We are going this way. So we can get to that tower. Tower is marked by a green thing on my map. Oh, see, it's right there. Oh, there's a wizard there. I do not want to mess with that wizard, so we're going to go around him. Whoa! Oh! Off the rock. Nope. We are going around the off the rock. There's the tower! I see it! Not getting that yet, because that will be very spoilery if I get it right now. Because it is out of order if I do that. I see it over there. Hooray! At long last, the Gerudo Tower!
to them, blow the phone away. Uh oh. There's a traveler needing help over there. Let's go help him real quick. Why not? We've got the hearts for it. Boop. We have the weapon for it. It's the question. Oh. Need to get a new toy con. There we go. Thing is, the crushing is messed up now. Using this toy con. Oh. I'm coming, lady. I'm coming. Hey, you. Oh, luckily I've got a gourmet meat and the berry and the other berry and another berry and another slurpy. There we go. Oh. Are you kidding me? It killed me in one hit. How did he kill me in one hit? I don't get it. Well, to be fair, it is a black Boko. Maybe I should just ignore that traveler for now. I really want to help. <laughs> no, I have to start all the way back here. Are you kidding me? I should have. I thought I would have saved. Hold on. No. Okay. Uh, I have to make my way back over there again, and I have no way of traveling there because. Uh, You know what, I'm going to do what I did last time and just go up this way. It's a lot easier anyhow. Yeah, I have a broken joy gun. What I might do... Uh, I'll do it after the part. I was going to put a new joy con on, but I'll do that. So your time. For now, just a broken joy con and it's having its issues already. Cause I dropped a switch and broke the broke it. <sighs> now the the shield button and the crouch button and stuff are messed up. The joy the joystick part's fine, it's just the shoulder buttons that don't work correctly. I've done this once before. Because it has a little bit of a lip right there. I can stop and take a stamina break if I need to. Okay, yeah. Because of the lip, I'm going to need to. No! I am so glad that it has that. I'm going to head towards this one over here, where there's a little bit more of a lip. And I have to do it again, because that Boko killed me. This time I'm not going to try and help that traveler. I am just going to go on. Oh, there's a wolf right there. Oh. He might be picking up my scent. I don't know. I see the wolf right there. Oh my word. Oh, don't you try to attack me while I'm climbing up, dude. That would be rude. Rude as heck. Oh, no, I can't shield because my shoulder button's broken. Shieldless run. Let's go. Well, shieldless part, I should say. It's just going to be a shieldless part because the Joy-Con is broken. Next part I'll make sure I have both Joy-Cons working. I did not even check them before I started today. Okay. 
So does that mean oh, I can't use my oh so okay so it's gonna kind of be like doing breath of the wild almost almost obviously it's gonna be conceptually different but uh, except that breath of the wild lets you use a shield too and both games that use a shield the only thing is I have a broken joy con so although this one okay this one works yeah it's just the left one that's broken. Okay, now, don't worry about the Traveler. Get yourself killed if you mess with him right now. We're getting plenty of utilization out of Tulin's ability. And I see the pure towel right there. And we're not getting the dragons here, we're just having to travel over the geoglyph to get to there without triggering the oh you're out of bounds type stuff. And I've actually did triggered that before by accident and I was like, oops. Because I hadn't discovered that portion of the map yet. And the game was letting me know it by having like just I don't know what exactly happened, but he kind of zoned out and uh, collapsed. And I was like, um, okay. And remember, do not pay attention to that traveler. Do not worry about the traveler. Go towards the traveler. Like you were intending to. Meow. Boop. Okay. And we're getting in the higher temperatures now. Let me put. Oh, I, can, I guess I can. Oh, uh, no, I can't shoot. Okay. That Joy Con issue is coming a big problem already. Well, you know what? Once we get to the tower and get the thing unlocked, I'm going to switch Joy Cons. So. Hopefully, oh, right, I forgot you take damage from heat. Well, I do have food. I do have food, so. Heart and half of damage. Ooh. I'll let it save real quick, just in case something happens. That's why I entered the pause menu. I was like, you know what? I am going to to. Oh, you know what? I, I, can't, oh, I can't change my equipment because. <sighs> I wish I still had my pro controller on me, but I don't. Yeah, the one that I had from the other Zelda game. The other Breath of the, Breath of the Wild game, you know? Yeah. I do still have that controller, but I haven't synced it up to. Oops, I'm on the wrong end. Right now we're out of the really hot area. We're in the shade. Climb up here. I'm not worried about any Koroks right now. Okay. Isn't there some kind of issue with this Pyro Tower, though? Um, well, when I get to the Pyro Tower, I'm going to really quickly save. Um, and just end of the part so I can switch my Joy-Cons out. And then um, next time, we'll start from the tower and make our way to Gerudo Town to meet with Riju. But, uh, Burrito Canyon, Skyview Tower, yes, we've made it. 
And, um, yeah, we can't use, oh, we can't use Ultra Hand. So I'm going to have to save here and stop anyway. All right, so uh, next time we'll pick up at the Gerudo Skyview Tower and uh, make our way to Gerudo Town to begin the Riju quest line. After that, um, we will do some more map exploration and um, unlock some more towers and hopefully find more shines too. Um, and during that, we'll also try to get the glide armor because. I don't like not having it and being this deep into the story. So those will that will be our goal for the next few episodes. And I hope you guys have a lovely day. Thank you. Bye.